this photography, this exhibition in our chambers really highlights some of those hidden parts of Florida that you don't see every day unless you get out in a boat or go out into the swamps and see how the land intersects with the water. I call this exhibit Hidden Places of Florida. I grew up on the St. John's River hunting and fishing and camping uh, throughout Central Florida. And I love taking people out on the river to show them different places that they may mostly haven't seen before. So being able to show my photography gets people to be able to see some more areas that they may never get to. These hidden places, they just teach us to respect the land, the water, the water quality. There's so much that we don't know, that we haven't seen, that we haven't explored uh, in our county and in our cities. And I think this is an opportunity for us to be awakened to the beauty that's all around us, that we are so busy with life that we overlook sometimes. And so it's great to stop and take a moment and understand and look and just reflect and begin to understand that this is where we live. Yeah, Orange County is incredibly diverse. So these exhibitions are a library of visual delights, giving our citizens different genres, different stories, different experiences with the art. John Muir has a quote. He says, in every walk with nature, one receives far more than he seeks. And that's what I believe when I go out every time and see at early morning in the dawn and see the, the light just start, it's like God's turning a dimmer switch up and all of a sudden things come alive. You hear the birds start flying and it's just, uh, it's just part of my, my soul. <laughs>